Hi, I'm Dr. Noah Erickson of Dr. Noah's Ark, and I'd like to tell you what makes us so different. We specialize in offering epigenetic testing. That's a buzzword of the past few years that means we are not pre-programmed to be destined to the fate of our genetics. In other words, you may have tried specialized programs for your child with ADD, ADHD, Asperger's or autism using high doses of vitamin B12 only to learn later that they had regression or adverse symptoms. Perhaps you tried various supplements, vitamins and minerals only to find out that your child has a negative reaction. Well, the science of epigenetics seeks to ask the question, what type of B12 is healthy for your body? And what type of vitamins like folic acid do you need to specifically turn on or off genes? Simply put, we can have predisposition to conditions like autism, heart disease, diabetes, and cancer. But if our genes can be turned on or off to promote or sequester a disease, we're able to influence our genetic destiny. So the take-home point is this. So many times parents have come to me on various protocols designed for autism and sort of a one-size-fits-all or cookie-cutter program. I don't believe in that. What I do practice is nutrigenomics, and that's using nutritional analysis and testing in conjunction with genetic testing to find out what your child needs. Therefore, when I go to recommend B12, it's not uncommon that of the five types of B12, we'll recommend a combination and excluding some because that could make your child's condition worse. So in summary, when I sit down with a child, I take great pride in personalizing their treatment plan and using custom drugless nutritional prescriptions, such as B12 and folic acid, but in the form that's right for their body. Therefore, it takes out the guesswork and eliminates the negative adverse reactions and side effects that parents so often report. So this topic was initially reported by Time Magazine several years ago and has now caught on. In the year 2003, the Genome Project was completed and many people were fearful of learning their genetic destiny. Well, we needn't. The body like a computer has an editing software program inside of it called methylation. And many of you may know this term. Perhaps somebody working with a patient with hypertension or high cholesterol has already thought about getting these pathways assessed. Relevant to your child, these pathways turn on and off brain chemicals like switches or light switches on a wall activating the ceiling lights. And what we can do is help them maintain those happy, feel-good brain chemicals like serotonin and dopamine. So many times parents report their child has temper tantrums, crying spells, anger outbursts, sleeping difficulties, problems with focus and concentration in the schoolroom setting, and that's because they have underlying genetic predisposition. So what we do is search that family tree by using unique genetic testing of both the blood and saliva to find out your child's unique genetic profile. Based on that and underlying nutritional and metabolic assessment tests, we put those two together like a good marriage and formulate your child's treatment plan. So in summary, again, nutrigenomics, the study of nutrition and how it interacts with your genes, and epigenetics, the pathways around genetic problems, or we call mutations, are cutting-edge, scientifically-based protocols that we use for your child. 